picture on WhatsApp. You're still with a 10 mic. Oh, I We saw it together. Marcus, they want to do another gig. I was getting on, I was going, getting, coming home on the bus and just we were coming around the corner. I saw a, a fellow in a green and yellow t-shirt and he was going that way. But then I saw him go the other way and I heard people yelling and screaming, running. So I said, okay, and there must be something going on. So I saw the yellow, uh, blinded a copper. So I, so I saw her and I followed her all the way upstairs up near there and I followed her. And just as we got to around the, around the corner, because I saw them coming, just as we were coming around the corner, there he was, he just came in and just started floating towards us, and all I heard was, put it down, and then um, she shot him, but we were not, if he, she didn't shoot him, well, uh, he would have kept going, he was on the rampage, he was on the bloody rampage, and then, then she walked over and gave him, C, then was giving him CPR, so, and it had a nice big blade on him, so, she chucked the knife away, and yeah, he looked like that, he was on the killing spree, on this side, because when we come downstairs, there was another two bodies near the wedding near the wedding shop. Inside, looked like they must have been stabbed. Just inside, one looked like a female and a male, but I don't know any more was in the shop. But yeah, I'm um, just and yeah, I just I don't know how many more. And I just wish it was. I hope there was no kids involved or anything like that. But yeah, I saw um, people running like quite clearly in one direction and behind them um, was a man with a knife running towards different people. He was running up to them or, um, you know, trying to... I, I don't know what he was doing. But then um, we went into the gym because I was right outside that and we are trying to close the doors to the gym when we heard the gunshots, which um, I understand now were the police, but at the time we didn't know that, so I think, um, yeah... It's something you just you, you see about overseas. You are grateful we don't go through this in Australia. Um, but um, and I think a knife is one thing when it's a floor away from you and you can see it and it's not an immediate danger. But gunshots are a completely different thing, right? Because you don't know where they're coming from. They can get you from a distance. And so I think it is that that um, that certainly panicked everyone. And I think we all just raced back into the gym at the time, being like, what's going on here?